Darrell Henderson is going to be a top running back this year. Let me explain. So Darrell Henderson was drafted three years ago, presumably to be the heir apparent to Todd Gurley. He showed explosiveness at times and showed that he could be a lead back, but injuries plagued him and he just couldn't really get through the injuries. That led to the Rams drafting Cam Akers and Cam Akers had an amazing end to the year last year, leading people to believe that this was going to be a one back backfield. Well, Cam Akers just got hurt and that leaves the Rams offense wide open for at the running back position. It is now looked at as Darrell Henderson's spot to lose and he is the number one back for the Rams which could lead to him being one of the best running backs in the NFL for a couple of reasons. Henderson said after Friday's practice that if it's on him then he's ready for it when talking about the lead back role. When Sean McVay was asked about it, he said that he needs to find a balance between running backs, obviously citing Henderson's old injury problems. But I'm here to say if Henderson can stay healthy, he could be a very, very solid running back for the Rams, even one of the best in the NFL. I say this because sharing the offense with Cam Akers last year, he was still the 11th best running back in the NFL. Now it's hard to get your running game going if you are constantly week by week sharing the offense, not knowing what kind of snap count you're going to get that week and he was still the 11th best running back in the NFL getting a 79 run grade and a 67 receiving grade which made him the 18th best running back in terms of receiving and it's not even Darrell Henderson's explosiveness or just you know ability at the running back position the situation that he is in is just set up for him to succeed he has Matthew Stafford at quarterback now which people think will be one of the best quarterbacks this year because of Cooper Cup, Robert Woods, and Tyler Higbee. So he has a very, very good receiving threat. So people will have to guard both the receiving attack as well as the running attack. And to top it all off, the Rams have the eighth best line according to PFF, having Whitworth, David Edwards, Austin Corbett, Bobby Evans, and Rob Havenstein. Not only that, but he is making plays like this with Matthew Stafford right now, where Matthew Stafford is throwing no looks. So he will definitely be a threat in the receiving game as well. And that is why I think Darrell Henderson could be one of the best running backs in the NFL this year because he is just set up for success in this offense. Everything around him is working perfectly, so he is most likely going to succeed as long as he can stay healthy. But those are just my thoughts. What are your thoughts? Go ahead and comment them down below. I'll try to get back to as many as I can. And then also consider leaving a like and subscribe as it really helps with the growth of this channel if you found any value. But my name is Zach and I hope Hope to see you in the next Rams fan content.